Hello everybody, and welcome back to Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. The Hello Buffy, she's coming in to watch. My name is Misty. Hopefully you guys are ready to get back into the Glitz Pit. I used to accidentally, when I was um, a lot younger, say Glitz Pits. But, hey, <laughs> you're a kid, right? Actually, when did this game come out? Anyway. Let's see what's going on out here. Oh dear. Oh, everybody's, you know, screaming over the bird. I think Gumbella calls him a chicken at one point. I mean, yeah, yeah. KFC's calling. I'll be able. What's Gumbella have to say? Uh, the champion, Rock Hawk. He sure has star quality you'd expect from a champ. But you know what? Who cares? Everyone knows we're gonna be the champions. I mean, eventually. Huh, the Great Gonzalez? You're a minor leaguer and your name is Great Ha. Uh, smacked Rock Hawk, yes. Get out of the way, get out of the way. I want to run to the store and get a few items. No, stop it at once! This behavior is unacceptable! In a, in, in, in a, fo in a food stuff? I insist you desist! What? Oh, I could get them already? Oh, alright, okay. No, please come back to me. Someone help. My rare imported egg has escaped. Please catch it. How dreadful and helpless to catch it, oh, despite the lack of its total arms or legs. However, shall I make my famous spotted egg dog now? Woe is me. I ordered that incorrigible egg from an island in the south where there were shipping costs. Well, don't just stand there. Help me catch it. Hmm. From an island in the south, you say? I wonder where it was from. Absolutely unacceptable in a polite society. And since you come down here once, Egg, how am I to reach you up there? Fly like a common sparrow? If I remember right, the egg's just like, I don't care. And yeah, and then falls asleep. Oops, sorry, I meant bump the mic. Oh, he just says the same thing. I thought he said something different. Well, we can fly. And we already lowered that down. We might as well go get the egg. Let's go. I almost flew over it. I've never had that. Oh, it's Benson. Huh? Did you hear that, Mario? You don't want to be eating, little Waggy Waggy. That's so adorable. What should we do, Mario? Should we help it? Help the little guy. I'm, I I. wonder what would happen if you say let there be eggs. Because, I mean, this is um, scripted. You have to take it with you. But, uh, well, if you're going to say that, Mario, then I guess we should help. Mr. Hot Dog Guy, st Mr. Hot Dog Stand Guy. It looks like this egg doesn't want to be eaten. Is it okay to let it go? Oh, very well, fine. I suppose there's not much market for cuisine that jumps anyway. <laughs> awesome! Did you hear that, little Eggy Waggy? Why is she doing that? You're free! Well, see you around. Huh? What is it now, Eggy? You wanna follow us? Is that it? I'm pretty sure our little buddy here wants to hang with us. Do we let it? Yeah, so we can follow us. It's just an egg. You hear that, little guy? Just make sure not to get on our way, though, okay? I mean, um, I was coming to get some items. <laughs> oh, it's a single one of me. <laughs> me too. 
I don't think y'all have anything quite as annoying as the bandits. Because... I don't like when they steal stuff. And it seems like if they stole stuff and ran away, I had to do the, uh, their, their fight again. Because, like, somehow they win if they run away. But something doesn't match up for what I'm thinking. So I have no idea. I think I still... Ha oh, wait, where's my items? I have a single... Mu uh, no, no, I have a couple mushrooms. Uh. Oh, I need to get rid of that dry shroom. Hey, can I sell that dried shroom? Are you even gonna give me any money for it? Because I think it's like one coin anyway. Oh, okay. Or maybe it was two coins. Yeah, one whole coin. That's wonderful. Um. No, I think we're good there. I think we're good there. Um, I might just buy one more offensive item. Earthquake! Five damage. It attacks everything. So we'll do that. Thank you. One, one. Look at it bounce with me. It's so cute. Alright, let's head back to the locker room. Hey Band Andy, what you doing? Hey there Gonzalez, how's it going? Me? I'm doing research. Hey, speaking of, what, of which, have you heard of the Seven Wonders of the Glitz Pit? This place has rumors and secrets and spades, but the Seven Wonders of the Glitz Pit are the most mysterious of the bunch. These things fascinate me, so I wander around doing research on them. Well, so how about it? Want to hear about Seven Wonders or not? Well, I was going to go do some stuff first. I smell rat behind all this, and someday I'm going to solve all these mysteries. Hey, if you ever want to hear more about this stuff, just say the word, okay? You stay there, Mr. Egg. I tell you, man, with all the young talent like you coming up in the ranks, you just keep feeling older and older. Know what I mean? King K ain't getting any, any younger. Is it me or am I giving everybody, you know, the uh, southern draw? Or half giving them th that draw? Could be ranked match. I don't remember where we're at. The mind of all. Oh. Nah, they're, they're fine. I don't really need an item on them, depending on what's going on. Alright. Alright. Fine. We can do that. As the little chair squeaks. Let's go. Great Entanglers, yep, a fight to the finish with the Mind Bogglers. Prepare to be ensnared, mystified, and devour. Hey, devour? I run, devour! Sorry about that if you heard a uh, fan running in the background. Didn't realize it was uh, that loud for some reason. Okay, so we don't want to swap partners, thank goodness. Uh, and they're all tattled on. I, I'm i glad that that stupid thing is there in the corner. Because otherwise, I'd forget already. Alright, since we don't have to tattle...
you guys can hear the clicking from my controller. Oh, wait, no, I don't have to tell. What am I doing? Mr. Piranha's gonna try to bite us. Let's see if I can. Oh, whoa. <laughs> no. The timing was off incredibly. Okay, so just go back to my hammer. Can't swap partners. So. Drive the cow crowd wild with some appealing and see if we can. Got it that time. So it'll cut the battle shorter by one turn. Nice. Yeah, yeah, we know, we know, we know. Listen, man, keep it under your hat, but I'm thinking about retiring soon. If I stay any longer, well, my future might get shorter, you know? So after the next match, I'm gone. It ain't cool to quit and run, that's for sure, but you know what? That's life, Double G, man. Listen, you stay cool, okay? Promise me you won't forget you once knew King K. King K's gonna retire? Oh my goodness, what do we do? That's kind of sad, isn't it? We've known him for like, what? An hour? Uh, I mean, video game time? I wouldn't know what that was gonna be. You can't retire, King K! Oh yeah, that's right. I can skip that. I keep forgetting I can do that. I don't know why. Ranked match. Oh boy, how did Gonzalez fix him for a fight? Your next opponent will be ranked 12 in the Glitz Pit, the Punk Rocks. The, the Punk Rocks. In this battle, I want you to avoid using any of them special moves. Okay, so no stars. I think the Cray Elves are even a nice long battle at its simplest and finest. Okay. At least I can swap partners if I need to. Oh, and it, I wasn't quite in front of it. Dang it. All oh, these guys. Okay, Clefter. The Green Torture Squad, a fight to the finish with the Punk Rocks. This is no take long. This ended pain for a mustache. Well, I mean, it might. Don't use a special move. Okay, yes, they are not having on, so. And that dude over there has a freaking rock! He has the earthquake. That's a hyperball cleft. Like clefts and ball clefts. This is also a rock monster. HP 3, attack 2, defense 2. This hyper version can build up its energy, boosting attack to 8 on its next turn. It has low HP, but. Hello, Twinkie. But its body is rock hard and pervious to fire, making it super tough. It says here that an I the items are pretty effective. Beat it before it goes hyper. Can an earthquake work on them? <laughs> well, I didn't use special move, Grubba. And Mr. Twinkie's just gonna lay down there on the floor and watch TV, apparently.
Yeah, yeah, Jolene. Keep going, keep going. And King K is gone. Developing a reliable style is good, but don't forget to try new things. That's the way you make new discoveries and really grow as a fighter. Great platform can't think of think of criticism for mustache. I kicked your butt. Bandy Andy's not here. Is Bandy Andy still outside? I mean, if he's outside, that's not too bad, I guess. Yeah, here he is. Let's just read one of them. Because I'm not going to read all of them. The man-eating toilet? I'm sorry we sat there for a minute reading that, but it was like, what? So we get the steel wall. The man-eating toilet. The stairs of mystery. The haunted wood, wood... I can't say that. The spooky ring lights. The missing ones. And Grub on Jolene. Let's just go to the sealed wall. They say there's a sealed wall in the Meyer League locker room. Are you talking about the uh, blog that happens to be there? You screaming, you know, something? Some say the remains of the falling athletes are stored in there. Actually, that wasn't as long. I, you know what? Let's just talk about Grub and Jolene. Grub is a strange one. His body is incredibly toned, even though he's past 60. Whoa, okay. I don't think I clicked on that before, because, dang, that's, that's, uh, that explains a couple things. He must have an exceptional training regimen to make you laugh. Then there's the matter of Miss Jolene. They say she suddenly vanishes at times. Some say a fighter saw her go into the bathroom and waited for her to come out. But she never did. Huh? You think it's you think it's a stranger that someone s s staked out her bath? <laughs> you think it's stranger that someone staked out her bathroom? Yeah, good point. And doesn't say anything else. Yeah, yeah, we'll uh, we'll learn some more stuff. We're gonna save just to make sure like everything is okay. You know, up to this point because well a certain condition is with this egg depending on what we want in it it's going to take a little bit hi grabba what's going on fix for a fight the bomb squad avoid using your hammer not even once I, um, I don't know if it's safe to jump on the bombs, but, um, I guess we're going to give it a try. I mean, I could always use a, um, super, and hopefully immobilize them. Big... The big bomb boomers, yep, a fight to the finish with the bomb squad. Here we go, Gonzalez. Have advice. Just give up now. Oh, sorry. Don't use your hammer. And they definitely aren't toddled on. So what if... I tattle on this bomb here. That's a bomb. The attack's but blowing itself up. Yeah, real smart. HP 4, attack 2, defense 1. A bomb will get totally mad if you damage it. They have, like, s super short fuses. I mean, that's a pun right there. Thus, you're not watching this? When it gets mad, it'll chain, it'll charge and explode on the next turn. That attack really hurts. Oh, and if it's mad, it'll blow up on the, at the slightest contact. So don't attack directly. Attack from a step away with a hammer. I'm not allowed to use a hammer. Or hit it with something hard, like a shell. I can swap. I can swap. But what I want to try to do, since I'm not allowed to use my hammer, I want to use this. You'll probably hear the clicking now. 
since I have to mash the button. Okay, good, good, good. We got them immobilized. That'll help, as long as I don't... As long as I remember, don't use my hammer. So let's head bonk. And just see what type of... Okay. We get the Goombella, let's swap out to... Um, Coop. So what happens when we do this? They all get for two. Okay. Now they shouldn't be immobilized, but they shouldn't realize that I've hit them. Okay. So now if I do power shell again. Nice! No explosions! We got ourselves a winner. Yeah, I'd say I won that one pretty good. We did it, Mario. Is your fight money? Ooh, I got 12 coins this time. I wasn't paying attention when Jolene was handing me money. I was just like, yeah, yeah, give me money. It's quite lonely without King K around. No lonely, him too weak. Now him not here. Sound normal to Kleftor. You are in denial, Kleftor. I saw you weeping in that locker. Oh, I forgot about this. You actually have to watch this, so I might just speed up the footage so that you don't have to go through this like I am. Yeah, my name's Swoop. Sir Swoop. Nice to meet you. Yes, you. Swoop. Sir Swoop. <laughs> Time for your battle, bub. Follow me. I think I understand why they have you watch that. It's because of the upcoming battle and time and stuff. I won't... I'll wait until after. Because so, I don't want to totally spoil everybody in case you haven't seen it or know what's coming up. But as soon as it happens, I'll show you. Well, dog my cats if it ain't the Great Gonzalez. Fixing for a fight, huh? Yuck, yuck, who we? You're gonna love this. The next opponent is ranked 10th in the Glitz Pit. The Iron Adonis? Adonis? The Iron Adonis twins. That's right, you're darn tootin'. and you're finally gonna make it a go at the Major League, son. We're expecting great things from you, so don't let us down. Now listen, in this battle, be sure to use a partner skill at least once. The crowd loves a tag team, and they want to see your partner show their stuff, too. Now get in there and put your partner to work. Hmm. 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 <laughs> Match time! Follow me! I don't think it's been even 18 minutes, to be honest. Why is the window for that one so short and that one so short? Jeez. You got literally a minute for that. And now today's main event, the Major League awaits the 11th ranked Great Gonzalez. I am sorry, I stuttered on those. But only if he can beat the 10th ranked powerhouse as the Iron Adonis Twins. First, let's get the merciless executioner in here, folks. The Great Gonzalez. I might be trying to. 
make sure I got the time right, but we'll probably have to do it again. Hey, Greg Gonzalez, how you feeling? Uh, okay, I guess. Well, Nelly, you heard the, f heard the fellow folks. He's all the itching to mix it up. Good gravy. Iron them out. Wow, are spikes legal? You didn't ask that when we were fighting little spiky dudes. Your challenge is real confident, boys. Yep, he's talking trash. Iron Adonis twins, he says. More like paper dog face bros, and they stink. Memoria didn't say anything like that. And then he said, I bet they just play video games and cry when they lose. Yeah, and then he said, Audi belly buttons run in their family, stink wads, and so on. Yep. Mario didn't say any of that. What? How does he know mom has an Audi? That jerk! We're gonna blend you up in a smoothie, pal, and then you're gonna and then we're gonna drink you. Oh, and one more thing. Only smelly stink wads call other people stink wads. Understand, stink wad? I love that logic. Simmer down there, bro, you stinkwad. You're gonna regret opening up your yap, pal. See these bods? Solid iron. See these spikes? Yeah, they penetrate any substance. So basically what I'm telling you is that whatever you try to be will be completely useless. Think that over for the very short time you have left with a functional brain. Mm, now, I mean... We're gonna do it! We're gonna make the Major League if we win! Get psyched, Mario! <laughs> Give it up now. Well, Stinkwad, you're about to learn the <laughs> about our skills the hard way. Uh, partner move at least once. I mean... What if... What? Why? What? Okay, well, I mean, it's Mario. I just wanted to swap. I'm gonna... I'm gonna, um... Tattle on both of them. But honestly, we can't do anything. We kind of have to run away. That's an iron clef. That guy's scary, period. HP 6, attack 4, defense is unknown? What is with this book? It says no attack will work against the iron clefs. It says nothing in this world is as hard as an iron clef, so its defense is impenetrable. Now that's true, the only way to beat it is to whack, whack it with the other one. Running away might not be a bad idea at this point. So I don't even think you can super guard him. Whoops. <laughs> I missed my super guard. Ouch, 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 ouch. Swap, swap, swap. Thank you. Cause just because they have different colored shoes, they're different. That's an iron glove. The green shoes must mean this is the younger brother. You know, Mario reference. HP 6, attack 4, and defense is unknown? What is with this book? I think it's saying the same thing. Yeah. Okay, well, we might as well run because there's nothing we can actually do. Yeah, there, there isn't anything you can do. You can sit there and try different moves, special moves and stuff like that. Technically, it's a scripted event. So you have to lose. Hello, phone. How'd you like that? We tried to tell you, but no. If you want another piece of pummel pie, have a bath and come back, punk. Here's your fight money. One coin, Mr. Gonzalez. Yeah, because I ran away. Your rank will remain at 11 because you lost the match. Now, if you excuse me, I must be going. Yeah, you can sit there and actually try to uh, battle him if you want. Or you can just run away, it makes it easier. Hey, check it out, our little achy friend is gone. Didn't see that coming. Or going for that matter. Where do you think it went? Yo! What color? He's green. He's green! Wait, he's green? That means he went past the two colors. All right, so I guess when I do that, okay, yeah. So technically there is a time frame for the colors and everybody voted for the black color Joshi. Technically
technically that means because I did not do that in six, he he was not in in um an egg for six minutes. There, I couldn't have done it that fast. Because if that's the case, I have to wait eighteen minutes. So we'll 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 do this again as soon as he's done talking. We'll skip through the dialogue because I'm not gonna read it. But um. And then we'll try and see if we can get the black one. So I'll, I'll cut it here. And I will join you back when uh, we have the black one. Holy crap, guys. Finally. You want to know how long this little black thing has taken me to get? Almost five freaking hours. As long as you don't count the... You know, hour recording? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Gonzalez, check me out. Thanks to you, I had safe and sound. Thanks, man. What? Did you wear that cute little eggy waggy? Kumbala stop that. Whoa, that's wild. Yeah, but who cares? You guys wouldn't be champs, right? You want a crystal star. Anyway, I gotta repay you for saving me from that old hoggle out there, so I'll fight for you. I can hold my own. I'll swallow any opponent whole. Honest. Just leave it to me. Huh? M my name? Well, I just came out of the egg, so I guess I don't have an egg or a name yet. Well, you seem fired up about it, so why don't you give me one? Make it cool, okay? I sat here for a while thinking about it, and, um, I can't, whoops. It's not capitalized. I need to capitalize. Came up with the name Cole. Because, why not? He's black color. Charcoal, right? Yeah. Cool, huh? Not bad, dude. Not bad at all. Yeah, like, well, you're gonna have to deal with it, buddy. <laughs> and here's the thing. I might even call him Yoshi throughout the, uh, the game anyway. Okay, Gonzalez, let's go out there do some damage. The Yoshi is now your friend. He'll answer to Cole. There is also somebody else trying to be my friend and eat my pizza. Hello, you cannot have my pizza. Yoshi's abilities. Press X to ride Yoshi. You'll move much faster when riding Yoshi. Try moving around. And you actually do. It is so nice to be able to run around. While jumping, hold A to float through the air for a brief time. Use this ability to cross otherwise impossible gaps. You can stop riding Yoshi by pressing X. That concludes this primer. Do you feel like you've mastered Yoshi's abilities? Yeah, I think I've mastered them. It's not that hard. In battle, he can repeatedly bounce on enemies using his ground pound move. Or use gulp to inhale enemies whole and spit them out for massive damage. So since this has taken me so, so much more time than I expected. Because I kept getting orange. I kept getting pink and green. And it's like, what in the world is going on? Why am I not getting this color? Let's go win a match. With me by your side out there, your opponents won't stand a chance. Well, Cole, I appreciate that, but we're gonna go save. Just because it ta it, it had taken so long to get you. All right, we're gonna fight uh, the Iron Heads, and then I'm gonna stop. Yeah, it'll be a little bit shorter. I'm sorry on that much. But trying to get this Yoshi color has drove me insane right now. So I kind of want to just take a, take a, a, a small break from playing. Also, if you hear any purring, Twinkie is right here. All right, fix him for a fight, Gonzalez. Okay, then. Your next opponent is uh, the Iron Adonis twins. Again. Now listen, be sure to use a partner skill at least- I have to use a partner skill, so don't worry. 
Cloud, the cloud, mm, the crowd loves a tag team and they want to see your partner show their stuff too. Now get in there and put your partner to work. Don't worry, my partner is really going to go to work. Gonzalez, match time. All right, let's go. The Armored Harriers, yep, a fight to the finish with the Iron Adonis Twins. You think you could take me and Gonzalez? Ha! These ultra hard bods just can't lose. <sighs> and they both should be tattled on. I made sure to do that. Right. Gonzalez, let me at them. We're gonna take these punks this time. <laughs> Stink was challenging us again. <laughs> he just never learns. Looks like he brought some new shrimpy partner. Cause if that's going to help him. You guys do realize that it's Yoshi, right? And you do got you guys do realize what Yoshi can do, right? Okay, yeah, they are both title on, so We'll defend with Mario and we will take Cole over here and we will Okay, we good we good now. Ouch! You spiked me right in the- oh, That really hurts! Our iron body and pony nastiness are being used against us! No fair! Dang bro, has he discovered our weak points? I might have discovered some weak point. <laughs> As the controller vibrates. And again. And go gulp! I forget where the stylish timing is for that. All right, we got 10 star points. Oh, five more, we, we could have leveled up too. Do we have to go back to the Meyer League now, bro? I think I'm gonna be sick. Congratulations, Great Gonzalez. With this win, you made it to the Major League. Now that, folks, was what I call a wild wooly fight. A, a diggity dang doozy. Keep it up, kid. You're going places. I can tell. Come on, folks. Give it up. we got a new major leaguer. Let's hear it for him. Here's your fight money. 14 coins. Yay. Your rank went up because you met the conditions. And Mr. Gonzalez, Mr. Greville wishes to see you in his office. Follow me. Hey, Grubble, what you looking at there? I swear the computer makes me think of a GameCube because it's got a green button and a, and a red button over there. Mr. Grubba, I brought Mr. Gonzalez as you requested. Uh, uh, Miss Jolene, you, you mind your manners now. We knock around here, Missy. Oh my gosh, I'm still doing him. I apologize, Mr. Grubba. And don't you worry your little pretty head about that. No, what did I want again? Something about Gonzalez? Oh, yeah. Gazelle is the old soul let me congratulate you, son. Made your leaguer already? I had a feeling you were going places, but dang, I love it when I'm right. You just keep putting those tushes in them seats. I'm counting on you. I had a special little something-something. Go on, take it. You got 30 coins. Nice. So yeah, something else that's been on my mind. Your costume ain't cool. No big deal, son. But hey, someday if you become champ, I'll get you a new one. Some hot paint, maybe with some frills or something. You look sight like a sight, son. Anyway, that, that's for another day, part. Take a powder, okay? Yeah, don't worry. I'm, I'm, I'm about to. Mr. Gonzalez, please follow me if you would. <clears throat> I literally think I just gave Jolene that accent, too, and I wasn't even trying. Bandy Andy, what are you doing? Are you trying to listen in our conversation? How dare you? This is the Major League Locker Room. You will use this room from this moment on. The match system is the same as the Minor League, but the bouts are harder. Try not to get completely destroyed out there, okay, Mr. Gonzalez? Well, if you excuse me, I must be going now. 
Do you like it's a pink one now? It's slightly translucent. Well, not everybody speak at once. What's the deal? Would it kill these guys to show a little friendliness? Sheesh. Stud the guy coming through. Listen up, losers. I've been hearing about some rising star tearing up the league. It's you, isn't it? Yeah, you fit the bill, skinny. A mustache named Gonzalez. Man, I came all the way over here for you. <laughs> what a waste of time. There's the crystal belt. What's your deal, Gonzalez, huh? Oh, the champ's belt? What in the- Hey, you! Get too close to the, ro the hawk and you might get rocked! I'm not sure, but it definitely looks weird. I think you're right, Gonzalez. Fake. Hey, you think you can just smack talk the rock hawk? I don't think so. You I got some guts calling my belt a fake, you shrimpy no belt having wimps. Didn't your mama teach you any manners? Oh, sorry, yellow dude. I didn't mean to rip on your big bad belt. Stop making fun of me, punk! You're the only alive because we ain't in the ring right now. If I see you under those lights, I'll tear you apart. Remember, the rock! Okay. Well, I really pushed that dude's button, didn't I? Well, forget him. We have a problem. Your map pointed to Glitzville, right? If that dude's belt has a fake crystal star on it, then where the heck's the real one? Mario, you're shaking. What is wrong with you? Gonzalez, is that your SP going off? Who'd you get mail from? If you wanted to know the crystal star, heed my instructions. From X. Also, I hope you enjoyed the little tune from X's email. It's another Mario reference. Who the heck is this X dude? He talks like he's the man to see about the crystal star. Why would he want to help us out, though? This whole deal seems kind of whack. Gonzalez, even if the belt's a fake, I think we should try the championship anyway. It's the best way to find out what's really going on here in the Glitz Pit. Yeah, pretty much. Anybody gonna talk to me? You're pretty tough, baby, but you're only really gonna have to power up to win here. Hey, where'd you get the hammer? You're biting my saw. I'm the hammer guy. I'll be the champ someday, you bet. Uh-huh, that's right. Just like the big legendary champion, Prince Mush. Nobody can beat Prince Mush. Except all the YouTubers on YouTube literally beating Prince Mush. Destroy the foe before you. That is the only concern of a true warrior. Um, let's see if there's anything in these. And it's not looking like it. Oh, ice storm. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. So I thought there was one. But, um, yeah. I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to call it here. Like I said, I've been doing this for five hours. I am gamed out for right now. But, we got our little Yoshi. We got our buddy. And, um, I might run him over to, um, Rogueport to see if I've got enough shine sprites to uh, power him up. Because it'll be very nice, because he's very useful in here now. I mean, and then I can use him to quickly run around, so. Anyway, make sure to give this a like. Take care, everyone.